poor, densely populated, and prone to natural disasters. Bangladesh has also long suffered with one of the world's highest rates of child malnutrition. The ill effects of malnourishment during childhood can last a lifetime, slowing cognitive development and reducing immunity to disease. In 2004, CARE, USAID, and the government of Bangladesh launched the Shuharto program to reduce malnutrition for more than two million people in Bangladesh's poorest communities. Shuharto One was a really dynamic and robust program that we funded. This program was really involved at the community level in the rural areas. We targeted those who were the most vulnerable, the poorest of the poor. Designed and implemented by CARE, the program's success stunned researchers. In less than four years, stunting, a measure of the shortfall of a child's growth due to malnutrition, dropped 28 percent within the program's target population. Uh, from the final evaluation, we found that we've had uh, some remarkable successes at the start of the program. We had an overall stunting of around 52 percent, and by the end line, we had brought this down to 36 percent. This is one of the most impressive results of any food security programs anywhere in the world. This was twice the success rate of the typical USAID-funded malnutrition program. Shuharto's attention to gathering objective data allowed researchers to determine that the program's single most effective intervention against child stunting wasn't direct food aid, it was women's empowerment. Shuharto offered women self-help groups where they could meet and address the unique challenges they faced in their communities, such as early marriage, violence, and sexual harassment when they went out in public, all of which restricted women's freedom and decision-making. The researchers found that the women who joined these groups started moving more freely. They traveled to markets to buy and sell goods, which increased their family's economic well-being. They saw doctors more frequently when they were pregnant, and they had increased say in their children's future. And they and their children began eating healthier diets. In Bangladesh, you're seeing real progress on so many of these fronts. Uh, the maternal mortality rates have dropped so much, infant mortality rates. It's really exciting to see what's going on, and other countries around the world can learn from the innovative activities going on in Bangladesh. The idea that women's empowerment can have a transformative effect on families and communities is not new. Every day, those on the front lines of the fight against poverty see what happens when you remove economic, political, and social barriers holding back women and girls. CARE has spent decades promoting effective, innovative strategies for nutrition with outcomes we believe will help reduce undernutrition, particularly if we ensure that the benefits reach women who are more likely to pass them on to their children. Focus on women if you want lasting, measurable results. Shuharto underscores CARE's belief that greater gender equality is the key to fighting poverty, hunger, and injustice around the world.